Okay, continuing on. This time we're gonna make a configuration file, and inside the configuration file is basically all your feeds and all the TV shows or movies that you want to uh, download. Um, so to set that up, you have to do this. Okay. Uh, first of all, open your home folder and uh, make this. Um, what is it? Maybe unhide it first, right? Unhide it. Show all hidden files. And if this folder doesn't exist, just go ahead and make it. But it's called dot flex get here. Right? Uh make that if you don't have it. And inside it we're gonna make a uh configuration file. So just right click on here and make a new document, empty one, right? And uh rename it to config.yml and open it and it'll be blank, but you have to fill up yourself, okay? So you do have to know the rules and how to set this uh, shit up, but uh, it's not really that hard. It's kind of confusing, okay? But let me show you. Uh, the rule is never use tabs. Use space if you have to, okay? Well, yeah, use space. And uh, first of all, you have to write it as feeds at the very top. This, uh, you only have to type it once, or you only have to write it once. But uh, everything under that is, you know, is separated by... Uh, let's see here two spaces so you see under feeds right you go down and then you go across one two right go down one two that's uh, the rule okay two spaces um, and you see how I don't have to have feeds anymore see so this one's part of that and so on and so forth so you don't you only type that once um, I'm gonna get most of these wrong, so don't don't you know think that I'm doing it right. This is just what I know so far. But anyways, let's get on to this. Uh, the thing after that, you can name it anything you want. I just ha I happen to name it by the TV shows, but you can name it like favorite TV shows or whatever. I call this top shows. It doesn't really matter. It's just a name, and you'll see why um, um, that's um, useful later. But anyways, here it goes. Uh, the RSS is basically the RSS that you're pulling from. Uh, so let's, I'll give you an example. Okay, this is where I get my RSS because I like this place. So this is show RSS, but uh, you click on feeds here and you click on your TV shows that you want. Let's say American Idol or whatever, and you get the public address. And all you gotta do is copy that, or you wanna open that and see what is inside. It's basically, you know, the series, right? Now let's get on to the series, of course. Right? Uh in here they have a plugin called Series and this will detect if the to if the file is a part of a series or not. And how they do that is basically if they see like, you know, season nine, episode sixteen, like this, and then they don't know it's a series because that's usually how torrents are, are, are named it. Okay. And um under the series is um, you know you have a little um, was it uh, dash and one space and then uh, the TV series that you want to download so basically I have uh, was it castle here right and I just want to grab all the ones that says castle uh, now this one is pretty convenient because it's only the castle in here but if it has other shows it'll just grab that one only uh, so that's what's that for and the downloads is basically where do you want your dot torrents to download to so I made a new folder I put it you can put it anywhere but I, I happen to put it in my uh, you know my downloads dot torrent folder so all the torrent files that they're gonna um, download is gonna go in here and uh, you'll see why uh, I made that folder in, in a minute later on but anyways back to um, what I was saying Another way to do this is um, now the torrent files can be from different sites, like I said. All right, some sites are are nice like this, where they just separate each show. Other ones are not so nice, and you see how they have like different shows, right? And so you have to use filters. So let's say if I want Castle only, I can't. I have these other fucking crap, and that's where filters goes comes in. Okay. Uh, so let's say if I have uh, a series that I want, and now you're gonna add this one in. Was it's called Reg Expert or I don't even know what the hell the syntax is, 
but anyways this is the syntax to filter so you have to type that and under that you can have accept rules and reject rules um, so let me give you an example so this one is loss let me see where's loss at okay this is the feed for loss and you see how this one just says loss in the shows um, the season and episodes and then this one has a 720p um, I don't want the 720p I just want the, the standard one and so you can do that like a, you say oh, I'll reject a 720p another example would be like uh, what is it uh, and again use space not tabs like cam because I, I, I don't want to see cam stuff right that's just another example you can do you say I don't want that big fucking crap you know and all that bullshit uh, another one is um, the accept basically if let's say some of them says a 720p but uh, you like some of them alright uh, 720p is in the line but uh, maybe you want um, 720p but only uh, you know the x264 so you can say accept that and I think it will bypass the reject rule once it has this one in there so that I think that's how that works but um, that's the general idea there's a lot more filter shit that uh, I didn't read up on <laughs> um, so that's the the general rule of how to make this and all you do is save it now and after that uh, we're, we're going to how to uh, you know test it out uh, so I'll end it right here